we're going inside the numbers on the very latest report detailing migrant encounters at the border. Here's ABC 15's data analyst Garrett Archer. 190,000 migrants were encountered at the nation's southern border, according to newly released data by the CBP, a 7% increase from January. Uh, looking historically, it ranks 24th highest dating back to the year 2000, but it's the highest number of encounters in any February. 33,000 more recorded encounters compared to uh, the last February in 2023. And finally, it's the 37th consecutive month of migrant encounters being over 100,000. And the shift we started seeing in January on where migrants were crossing the border continued. Last month, Tucson, still the sector with the highest number of encounters, uh, saw a small decline, uh, about 1,100, but the uh, large increases in the new numbers two and three, San Diego and El Paso, both seeing an increase of almost 7,000 encounters. Other Texas sectors continuing to see declines, Laredo and Del Rio, uh, once the largest, that dropped to fourth uh, and fifth, Del Rio. Uh, but back to Tucson, for eight consecutive months, this sector has been the, the one with the most encounters, overtaking Del Rio in the middle of last year. Uh, after a huge December surge of encounters, Tucson is down about 38 uh, percent, but a massive 80 percent drop at the Del Rio sector. Uh, there is also a shift happening on where migrants that are encountered are originally from. Only citizens of four countries, Cuba, Nicaragua, Mexico, and Haiti, are seeing rising encounter numbers uh, in the when the past three months are compared to the three months before that. The biggest decline is coming from Venezuelans, uh, typically first or second for monthly encounters uh, for the past year. It's a big drop of over 60,000. Uh, with a look inside the numbers, I'm Garrett Archer, ABC 15, Arizona.